In this short tutorial, I'm going to walk you through ListenWise, a um, website that features um, audio uh, content uh, for that focuses on developing listening comprehension in our learners. So I'm going to access, li access ListenWise through our link here on our Padlet. I'm going to log in with Google, choose my account, and now I will be my account. Right now, um, I am using the 30-day uh, uh, trial of ListenWise Premier or Premium, uh, which is um, a paid uh, part of the platform. Um, I just want to do this to so I can model a little bit more of the functionality. You still have access with the free account to the lessons with the audio tracks, discuss, discussion questions, and things like that. But the audio components um, and the classes. Um, are not available uh, in the free version. So um, I'm going to show you classes really quick. <clears throat> so I'm going to click on classes here at the top. You can add a new class. Um, it's really simple. Um, or you can even, if you're a Google Classroom uh, district, uh, you can add, um, import your Google Classroom. So if you add a new class, you're just going to simply name it. So I'm going to name this one Demo2. You check to accept the privacy policy. And then here you will have um, the link for your learners to sign up, and then also um, the class code that they'll need for that link. Um, in the assignments part, I'll click here. You can actually see um, your class, the assignments that you have for your class. Um, waiting right here and you can click on it and actually go in and see which class is assigned to um, who's actually uh, completed it you can edit the edit the assignment here you can even assign this assignment same assignment to another class um, and then you can also it's integrated with google classroom so you can click here and you can share on your google classroom so i did that one all right. Um, I'm not going to actually assign it to any of my classrooms at the classes at this time. All right. Um, next, um, I'm going to show you the lessons. So you can actually search for, look at all lessons, or they focus on, or the ones that focus on social studies, science, or ELA, or you can do the search. I'm going to do the search right now. Okay. So um, you see the different subject areas that you can search on. Let's focus on science. So I'm going to search science, language challenge. I'm going to pick medium, grade level, middle school, and then you can find it by lesson plan. But I'm also, I want to know, find the ones with um, uh, quizzes and EL sports. And it doesn't necessarily have to be a current event. So I uncheck that. Oops, no results. So let's just remove those. All right. So um, <clears throat> here are several articles. If you want to actually look at them, you can click on read more. And then if you want to, um, you can preview it. You can listen to the audio track right here. You can look at the, tran you have access to the transcript of it that you can look over. You can look at any assignment resources, the teacher's guide, apparently they're coming soon, as well as a quiz. And you can even preview the quiz as a student by clicking here. All right. So if this is actually a assignment that you want to, um, when you've reviewed everything that you want to use, you can either just assign the quiz or you can create an assignment with it here. So I'm going to just name this one test. You name it, you click save and go to the next, next uh, step. Uh, the listening organizer, I want the fact question response. So this is what the organizer as they're listening that they'll be completing. I can go in and I can look at these, I can change these questions and change the responses, or I can even add additional questions. Okay, I can add directions, so complete by August 24th or something like that, oh, but I should spell August correctly. All right, and um, so then once you hit save, now you can actually choose which class you want to assign it to, the due date, so I'll pick August 7th, 
and then you just click assign the class and there you are all right um, so now it's assigned to that class and it's gone to all those learners that are in that class and the other piece um, you can you can look at search is for um, the current event pieces um, they're pretty much anything you see going on um, currently in the country they're going to tap into and you'll see um, lessons uh, um, shortly after those events so that's about it um, i hope you find uh, listen wise to be a great resource uh, for your learners to start to uh, really develop those uh, listening comprehension skills that are uh, so necessary in their uh, in the world today thank you